Well, one family's continuous battle for their son's kidney health will soon come to an ease. This is thanks to a local woman's decision to give a helping hand during a time of need. Star Bodie spoke to the boy's mother and the donor about this special procedure. She joins us in the studio with more on this story. Star? Hi, Brian. After months of searching for the perfect match, Decaden will have a second chance at life with the things from a local and a compassionate woman. It's okay. I don't feel obligated. It's a miracle yeah, Samantha Marks was hoping for, even at just 26 weeks pregnant. That's when she found out the fate of her son, Decaden's health. His kidney shut down full assist. Um, he, I lost all amniotic fluid. They told me that he would never survive, that I should have, have him at that moment. Two-year-old Decaden had a 1% survival rate at birth, but continues to defeat the odds. Since he was just four days old, Decaden endured nine surgeries and restless nights of kidney dialysis while sleeping in his crib. Gina DiGello, Caden's soon-to-be donor, says donating her kidney is something she never thought twice about. You know, I've always wanted to do something like this. I've always, I'm a generous person. I, it makes me feel whole to give to others, so I really do like to do that. Um, and I've always talked to my husband about it. And Gina tells us that this procedure is humbling and will help create a healthy journey for Decaden. Can you show them? Can you show them your smile? <laughs> I'm taking risks and I have a family to look after as well, but his life is never going to be what it is, you know, again. It finally, it's going to change and he's going to be able to do things that he can't do now. A kidney transplant will create a new hope for Decaden's family. He has to go to sleep alone because he's hooked up on dialysis every night and because of her, I can cuddle with him at night. The Jello and Decaden's family say they've already created a bond that will last a lifetime. Talk, he points, he laughs. The procedure is scheduled to take place at the end of May. And if you're interested in giving a monetary donation to the family, you can find that link on our website at yourerie.com. Brian.